Hey everyone, Blue Lizard Jello here, and I wanted to take the time to make a quick video to show you something that I just learned recently that I've already put into practice, and something that I'm sure many of you are going to want to use when you're out there testing your build, or you're calculating the damage potential of the game's many weapons, and that's how to create a save backup of your current game progress. It's very easy, and it's useful when you want to keep a character low level, maybe to help your friends who are just getting into the game, or if your upgrade materials are limited and you don't want to risk wasting any. It's very simple. First start by going to your start menu and go into the search bar and you want to type in percent sign app data percent sign. So that's percent app data percent and then you're going to end up with this roaming folder. Go into this roaming folder and then the next thing you're going to want to do is locate the Dark Souls 2 subfolder which is right here. Double click in there. Now you're going to have this alphanumeric folder. It might not be the same as what you see on mine however this is where your game save is. Go ahead and go into this folder and then you're going to find an SL2 file. This SL2 file is your current game progress. Now it doesn't record individual characters, it's simply all your characters at the same time, kind of like a summary of where you're at in the game for everyone. What I like to do is create a new folder on my desktop. For this one I'll just call it the DS2 Save Backup. And it's as simple as going back to the SL2, copying it, going back into the new folder you just created, and pasting it in here. Now, this is effectively just created a backup. So now if you go into your current game and you do any sort of test, maybe you upgrade one item over another, if you don't like what you've done or you want to revert the changes, all you need to do is go into this backup that you've just created in this other folder and you'll copy it back into the Dark Souls 2 subfolder of the roaming folder that you found by going into, again, the percent app data percent, which I'm doing right here just to show you how easy it is. Go in here. And then all I'm going to do again, copy the backup, paste it into this folder. Now it may or may not ask you to replace it depending on what type of changes have been made. If so, copy and replace. Now you're ready to go back into the game where you left off and that's all there is to it.